since 2019, I've been out of prison 10 years, so I'm a little rusty. Just a little rusty, a little rusty. Clean uh, Street, I ain't been back in 10 years, though. 10 years. I'm saying, bro. Anyway, moving along. Let's see. What the fuck is up with Evelyn Snitch? Uh, you see Evelyn Snitch? <laughs> Look at Evelyn. Evelyn Lozada. <coughs> Lozada. <coughs> Evelyn Lozada. Basketball Wives. Sue's OG. Sue's Basketball Wives co-star OG for defamation. Calling her. What What the fuck did she call? Well, I can't move my picture out the way. Bro. Oh, there we go. Evelyn Lozada, Sue's Basketball Wives co-star, OG for defamation for calling her a racist bigot. Snitch ass, blood, snitch ass, Jesus, blood, got them, got them, got them. <clears throat> Is it cheaper to live there than Vegas? Live where in California? Fuck no. Are you talking about Victorville? Fuck no, because Victorville still in California. Fuck no. Vegas way cheaper than Victorville. Because Victorville, blood, Victorville is still California. So Victorville is still subject to California taxes. Fucking Vegas has no taxes. Blood. There is no tax. Gas still like $2.50 a gallon in Vegas. You know how much a gallon of gas is in Los Angeles, California, in the inner city right now? Just in the inner city. We ain't even talking about Hollywood. That shit like $10 a gallon in Hollywood. I'm talking about right here in Los Angeles. That shit like $5 a gallon right now, bro. Where the fuck would you be driving with $5 a gallon? You know what I'm saying? Like, like where the fuck would y'all niggas be driving? You niggas be riding all around the city because gas only like... 247 blood. This shit $5 a gallon, motherfucker. You know what I'm saying, bro? We don't play the Rams no more this year unless it's the playoffs. I'll DM you the schedule. Um, somebody playing the Rams. Who was playing the Rams? I don't know. We supposed to go to some Rams game. I forgot who it was. It was either the Saints and the Rams or the Rams and the Bengals. It might be the Rams and the Bengals, but I'm still coming to see the Saints, though. It don't matter. I'm still coming to see the Saints. <clears throat> uh, gas 265 in the natty. See what I mean? That's why you niggas could drive around all day like that. You niggas could just fill up with $20 still and drive all around all day. In L.A., it's like $50 to fill up. So once a nigga done spent $50 for the day, but that's like half of your day's budget. You don't supposed to spend no more than $100 a day. Like, like any normal motherfucker. I mean, unless you just rich and eccentric. If you just rich and eccentric, hey, more power to you. But us normal motherfuckers who got to work for our money, blood, and work hard for it, blood, I don't want to spend over $100 in a day, blood. What the fuck do I look like spending? Nigga, I got five kids in the future. Why the fuck would I be spending over $100 in a day? On what? On what, blood? Serious shit, blood. Like, what the fuck are you spending so much money for, blood? I live below my means, blood. You know why? Because I'm a broke-ass nigga. I'm broke as fuck. So I got to live below my... I, don't get me wrong. I do be shining, though. I make it look good. I be shining, though. But I'm really a broke nigga, so I live below my means, blood. So I can't spend over $100 in a day. Only when I be out of town in New York. I ain't going to lie. In New York, I spend over $100 a day. But in California, I can't spend over $100 a day. Fuck that. <clears throat> You gotta make it look good. You gotta make everything look good, blood. When you got a bucket, don't you gotta keep that bitch clean, blood? Just cause I got an old ass car, don't mean I can't keep it clean, blood. That's what I'm saying, blood. You gotta make it look good. Just cause I'm an old ass nigga, don't mean I can't stay shiny, blood. Street, blood. <clears throat> Smart niggas balling on the budget. I seen so many rich niggas go broke. Look at Holyfield, blood. This nigga Holyfield, this nigga Rick Ross, this nigga Holyfield paid 22 million, 23 million for that mansion. Like, how many millions did Holyfield pay for that mansion? This nigga Ross bought that shit for like 5 million, blood. 
got that shit shiny, bro. This nigga Holyfield working at Target or something, bro. I'm not lying, bro. Like, bro, this nigga was like a hundred something million dollar nigga, bro. This nigga working at like Target or Home Depot now, bro. Not that there's nothing wrong with it, because at least he got a job. But what I'm saying is, when you a hundred something million dollar nigga that got a mansion that Rick Ross bought, motherfucker, what the fuck is you doing working at Home Depot and Target, motherfucker? That's what I'm saying. You was fucking off the money. You was spending more than a hundred dollars a day. Mm -hmm. See? You know what I'm saying, bro? You was spending more than a hundred dollars a day. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, moving along, bro. What the fuck, bro? bro what kind of, bro? What kind of get out of jail free card do fucking Kim Kardashian got, bro? What the fuck, bro? Like, bro, how is she just getting niggas out the pen like this, bro? Momulo Stewart released from prison after 20 some odd years with help of Kim Kardashian, blah. What the fuck kind of get out of jail free card is she working with, blah? What the fuck, blah? Free little minutes, blah. Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. I got a couple prisoners for you to free, blah. Free little minutes, blah. Free my nigga bad boy, blah. Free my nigga, uh, free my nigga little bolo, blah. Who else locked up, blah? Blah. Free my nigga tiptoe, blah. Free booyah, blood. Fuck that, blood. I'm just saying, blood. Like, I got some niggas for you to free. What the fuck kind of get out of jail free card do she got, blood? I'm just saying, blood. That's some special shit, blood. She bracket. Hold on, blood. She bracket, bracket. She doing more than the governor, blood. Like, nigga, she done exalted more execution than the governor, blood. Serious shit. I ain't lying, blood. She been putting it down. Like, like I thought it was a joke at first. She really getting niggas up out of there, blood. Goddamn. What kind of get out of jail free car she got, man? Mm -hmm. Oh, damn, man. Serious shit. Like, that's strange, blood. Like, I ain't never seen that, blood. Who the fuck is she, blood? She ain't even like, blood. She got a big ass, blood. All this came from Ray J's meat, blood. How you go from Ray J's meat? Like, blood, serious shit, blood. How she go from Ray J's meat to releasing niggas from prison, blood? What the fuck kind of prison reform? Program she got bracket what the fuck, nigga, nigga, she went from rage serious shit, but this bitch literally made a beeline for Ray J's meat to the fucking to the fucking border prison reform, blood. What the fuck? How she do that? God damn, God damn. Serious shit, that's some amazing shit, blood. Like, blood. I know it sounds funny because I'm just a hilarious motherfucker, but that's some amazing shit, blood. All this shit started with Ray J's meat. Pause, no homo. Serious shit. Like, I don't know, what do we know her for before? When, when did we know her before Ray J's meat, blood? You know what I'm saying, blood? This nigga, like, this nigga, uh, what's blood name? Nick Cannon, try, oh, I hit that. Well, nobody cares, though. You didn't have no sex tape, though. Well, I hit that before. That was so fucking what, blood? Like that, blood? You ain't had no sex tape, though, blood. Fuck out of here, blood. We wanna hear that shit. But I hit before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I fucked Apple before. You know what I'm saying, blood? I fucked Apple Watch before. So fucking what? You know what I'm saying? So fucking what, blood? I don't got no footage, blood. So fucking what? You know what I'm saying, blood? Uh, I had an Android back then, but I had an Android. I didn't get no footage. My bad. My bad. <laughs> serious shit, like, like serious shit. I ain't got no sex tape, blood, so nobody cared. Like, you get, did you get a sex tape? Did you get some footage? No, uh, shut the fuck up, dude. You know I'm saying, we don't hear that shit. <laughs> Lying on the pussy, no pics, no proof. Like, you know what I mean? No pics, no proof. Like. But I got proof, though. You know what I'm saying, bro? Hey, nigga, I hate that. You know what I'm saying, bro? I ain't got a lot. But I, what I'm saying is, like, damn, nigga. You ain't got no footage. So who cares, blood? Like, who cares? It ain't like you got a sex tape or something. Like, blood. what do you think? Oh, my God. You fucking you're so fucking what? You ain't got no sex tape, though. Ray J had a sex tape, blood. That nigga got her bracken, blood. We didn't know about her before Ray J's meet. She was just, uh, she was Paris Hilton sidekick nigga before. Like, like, I seen her with Paris Hilton, but I didn't know who she was. I didn't even care who she was. But after Ray J's meet, pause, no homo. And I'm just saying, blood, like, I pictured my meat, like, like not that I was like worried about Ray J's meat, but I just pictured my own meat, blood, and I seen her in a different light. I said, hold on, bro. She deals with the meat. Hold on, bro. She's a butcher. 
she's a butcher. She deals with meat. And she's a butcher. She's a butcher. Let's see. <laughs> now, now, fast forward a few years. Fast forward a few years, a few decades, maybe. Nigga, she went from butcher to board of prison reform, but that's bracket. That's bracket. She was here from butcher to board of prison reform, bro. Shout out to Ray J, bro. Shout out to Ray J, bro. Without Ray J's meat, pause no hunger, none of this would have been possible. Seriously, <laughs> man. Shout out to Ray J, the camera, and Cancun. Where was y'all at? Cancun, Cabo. No, that was Cabo. Uh, shout out to Ray J and the paying for the Cabo vacation. I know you paid for that. Don't don't lie and say she paid for that. You paid for that, Ray J. Shout out to Ray J, the camera, and the Cabo San Lucas vacation. <laughs> the condo in Cabo. The condo in Cabo. <clears throat> You know she's getting something out of it and shit free. Man, you know fucking well she getting something out of it. But it don't matter what she getting out of it. She getting niggas out of prison out of it, blood. That's some amazing shit, blood. Whatever she see, you niggas worry about the wrong shit. Look at y'all hating that. You know she getting out of it and shit for free. Ugly ass nigga, who gives a fuck what she getting out of it? Niggas that had life that been sitting in prison for 20 something years is getting out, nigga, because of it, nigga. Motherfucker, fuck wrong with you. You, blood, is you not paying attention to the bigger picture, blood? You just looking at that big ass and you ain't paying attention to the bigger picture, blood. You know what I'm saying, blood? This bitch get niggas out of prison that been in jail for 30 years that had life, nigga. Motherfucker, that's some amazing shit. You know what I'm saying, nigga? <clears throat> Put some respect on her ass. You know what I'm saying, blood? Put some respect on her ass. <clears throat> Niggas getting out the pen. I like to think Ray J. Like, yeah, yeah. Shout out to Ray J. His meat, pause, no homo. His camera and the condo. What? The condo is in Cabo. The condo in Cabo. You know what I'm saying, bro? That was bracket. That was bracket. Without Ray J's meat, none of this would be possible. Because <laughs> the damn show wouldn't have happened off Nick Cannon's beef. Like, like, but, yeah, we ain't seen shit. We ain't seen shit happen after Nick Cannon. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Ray J. Ain't shit happened after Nick Cannon. All she managed to do after Nick Cannon was make it to Ray J. She trying to get Max B out. Free Max B then. Like, shit, bro. That's what I'm talking about. Free the real nigga, bro. Free all the real niggas. Free all the real niggas. AJ beat that thing up. Now my niggas getting out of jail. Serious shit, real nigga. Shout out to Ray J, man. Hey, blood. Do anybody, do anybody else think that Omarion baby mama sexy as fuck, blood? Omarion, she kind of ratchet, but she sexy as fuck, huh? Just asking for a friend. Asking for a friend. You know what I'm saying, blood. Anybody been checking out Ray, uh, Omarion baby mama? She fire, blood. Hey, man. Serious shit. Uh, she better than Cochran. <laughs> <coughs> Was the pun intended? <coughs> Was the pun intended? <laughs> she better than Cochran. <laughs> She's better than Cochran. Pun intended. Uh, pun intended. Uh, that was a good one, man. She's better than Cochran. <laughs> Kim is better than Cochran. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, she's sexy. I get them guts. Yeah, what's her name? April? April or something? She's sexy as fuck, blood. Omarion couldn't handle that, blood. You know what? I wonder if Omarion is struggling with his sexuality. Like, like, does he seem like a guy struggling with sexuality? So like, like, blood. She seems to know something we don't know. I'm serious shit. Like, like, blood. Don't nobody just choose up with your homie and start like, is she real adamant about it, blood? She seems to know something. That we don't know, blood. Serious shit, blood. He seemed like a nigga that cried to her or something. Like, he cried and 
confess to everything, but like, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. Marcus Houston and Marcus Houston and Rasby, they ran trains on us like they ran a train on us like a choo choo. Like, serious shit. <clears throat> like, but serious shit, bro. You seem like a nigga that cried to her. Like she seemed to know something we don't know, but like she real adamant and her hue is way too blue, blood. Her she got a blue hue, blood. She seemed to like like she seems to know like how damaged you are or something, bro. I don't know, but it just seems that way. I don't know. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. I don't know everything. I don't know everything. But I know a lot of things. I know a lot of things. I don't know everything though, but I know a lot of things. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> you know what I'm saying, bro? He missed one child support payment. All the tea coming out. That's what I'm saying, blood. Like, like, blood. He seen. She seemed to know something that we don't know, blood. You know what I'm saying, touch, touch. Like, you know what I'm saying, blood. You came up under a nigga that said, "Baby, take your clothes off. Let's get naked, blood." And Marcus Houston think he's slick, blood. How the fuck he get his black hair, black blood? Oh, Beijing head out, blood. Beijing the fuck up, blood. Looking stupid, blood. Safari looking out, blood. How the fuck he managed to get his ass on love and hip hop, blood? Hold on, blood. Like, why you even come back out? I thought you was a Jehovah Witness, blood. You was fucking lying, huh, blood? Get over here, blood. Let's bring them allegations back up, blood. Now you got Raz B trying to retract that statement. Y'all niggas think y'all slick. Y'all paid that boy all blood and trying to make a comeback blood don't think you slick blood all of a sudden right be you know i was on drugs at the time you know, blood you on drugs now blood but you were sucking dick at the time blood the fuck all of a sudden i was on drugs at the time i don't know i might have said some things no nigga you told the truth nigga you on drugs now nigga you still lying blood don't fucking lie, blood. You told the truth, nigga. Don't try to retract your statement now, nigga. You was adamant about it, especially after that call with the other nigga that seen the dresser. Oh, my God. How did you know about the dresser? How did you know about it? Because he seen that dresser when he was getting fucked on that bed, too. Buster, shut the fuck up. Don't fuck me. Oh, my God. How did you know about the dresser? Look at us. Look. Oh, my God. He had a mole. He has a mole on his balls, too. Oh, my God. How did you know about the mole on his balls? Look at that. Look, fuck, bro. Oh, the hell. And, and he has a mole on his <laughs> What y'all doing over here, blood? Even my own bitch that I sleep with every day couldn't tell me if I had a mole under my balls. <laughs> the fuck was y'all doing over here? <laughs> the fuck was y'all over there doing, blood? He has a mole. He has a mole. <laughs> It's no bitch, it's no bitch that I ever fucked that could tell you if I had them all under my balls or not. Like, blood, I don't think she examined my balls that heavy. <laughs> you was really examining this. What the fuck was y'all over there doing? <laughs> Playing God in the college? <laughs> Stay focused, bless. I'm gonna call y'all back. <laughs>